Like, what kind of gentleman are you? You'd be a terrible... He is a terrible person in the 50s. Like, what kind of 50s man does that? Like, the 50s was about chivalry and... All that awesome nice. male doing stuff for women thing, like opening doors and... Yeah, nice. Putting their coat over puddles. Like, when girls expect that now, I'm like, what... Okay, I'm gonna be nice to you, but what do you expect this is, really? 1950? It's 2010. You're supposed to be independent. You know, you're supposed to be strong and independent. Fuck if I'm gonna do all that shit for you. What do you do for me? Nothing, not a damn thing. You don't do a damn thing for me, so fuck that bullshit. But I'm a girl! I don't care what you are. Like, I don't care if you're the queen of fucking England. You want independence? You want respect? Then earn it. And many of them have, but some some of them are still very old-fashioned. Yeah. They're just gonna have to find an old-fashioned guy. Welcome to the modern era, where guys are douchebags everywhere. I, even I have something caught in my teeth, and it's really annoying me. I can't get it out, Come on. and I'm probably gonna have to brush my teeth to get it out. Nice. Come on. And the only reason it's annoying is because I know it's there. Coming up on our turn here. Wow. Worst turn ever, taxi cab. Worst turn ever. So are you enjoying this little trip through the entire city? I am. I know we've enjoyed it several times, this this DLC. Yeah, nice. I think that was a good, what, two, three minute drive? Yeah. Something like that. Pretty much a third of this DLC is driving. I don't know if that's counting the uh, car stealing missions or not. Okay, we don't need that really anymore. Okay, so here we are. We have to steal a police bus, apparently. That sucks. This is gonna suck. We're gonna have cops like all over our asses, and this is gonna take like three tries. Find and steal a police bus and deliver it to the garage. Oh, okay, sure. Just like stealing the stupid military jeep. We had to kill a bunch of military guys and then escape the police. So you're really not making that easy on me, huh? Really, really not. I don't know why there's a police bus just kind of sitting out here in the in the open. I can only imagine the cops are going to be chasing me. I can only imagine. Or not? Question mark? I blast through this. This is gonna be a really long and boring, annoying drive. I'll tell you that much. This horn is kind of funny, though. Oh man, this is gonna be a terrible drive. How far do we gotta go? Okay, we don't have to go terribly far, but nonetheless, it's going to be a pretty long, boring, terrible drive. I better start braking really early for whatever turn's coming up here, because this thing is not going to stop on a dime. And it's raining, which I can only assume messes with the traction. Alright. Okay, here we go. Breaking, breaking, breaking. Okay, that's pretty good. This isn't so terrible after all. I figured the cops would be on us and it would just be terrible and... Apparently they don't care if one of their police buses are stolen. I'd care if I had one of my police buses stolen. And kind of overshot the park parking thing. There we go. Easy. A lot easier and a lot better than I thought. Fine by me. Don't even care. So what do we got next? We have a mission that is actually semi-close. And guess what mission it is? It's another car stealing mission. It's always the car stealing ones that you don't want to do. I actually don't know how much more of the story we have to do. I know during the first half an hour that I recorded, there was only... Well, we had 60, like, 4% done. And I played for about a half hour, got a couple missions done. So I don't know what percentage we're at now. I'm probably just going to check after I'm done recording about a half hour of this. So. 
By my guess, I'm pretty sure we'll be at least set, at least at 75% or higher, which means we'd only have about a quarter of the game to go, or so, if you were bad at... a quarter of the DLC if you were bad at doing just math, fractions, and percentages, stuff like that. Well, not really fraction, but percentages, really. I guess it could be a fraction if you count it as three quarters of the game being done. Percentage if you go with 75%, it's all the same thing. I was bad at math anyway. Like basic math, I'm alright at, but language, language and history was more of my strong point. Ascot Bailey theft. Thank you. Okay, one in a million. Blah blah blah. I don't care about reading that anymore because it's the same bullshit. Don't care about the backstory. I don't learn anything about the characters. I no. I don't care if Jimmy dies, I don't care if the other guy dies, I don't care if the fucking Pope dies in this game. I don't give a rat's ass. What am I? Oh, okay. I, I really don't give a rat's ass. Don't tell me that that's this dude's car. What are you hanging around here all suspiciously for, dude? Oh, whoa. Whoa! That dude just got nailed by a car and didn't even care. Dude should have totally been dead. Alright, whatever. Pretty glad I killed the suspicious looking guys. They might have opened fire on me. Oh man, this car is sweet. I could do this all day. Holy shit, dude, this car is sound. Really? He hit me! Get out of the fucking way, you stupid piece of shit blue car. Now oh, we should be able to avoid this with barely decent ease. This car is sweet. I'm not gonna. Oh my god! <laughs> this car was sweet. I like mashed three different buttons on the controller once. Like the left trigger, B and A. Yeah. This car is fairly sweet. Like I'm pretty sure this is one of the single greatest cars I've ever driven in this game. Oh, 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 very slidey, very slidey. And we're here. Oh man, this thing is awesome. I love that thing. Yay! Another mission done with... Oh, look. Congratulations, you have finished all the car dealer missions. Thank you. Thank you very much. We don't have to do another bullshit car dealer mission again. This actually leads me to believe that we're probably a little bit closer to finishing the game than I thought. Maybe. I'll just take this guy for now. But hey, guess what? We have to travel about half the map away to get to the next mission, so... Going on another road trip. Who wants to go on an adventure? All of you do. All 5,000 or so of you who actually end up watching this in the not-too-distant future probably will. Usually I upload so much shit that most people aren't able to keep up with everything, which is why I'm sure most of my view counts aren't as uh, as high as they should be. Like I'm sure if I uploaded one video a day, you know, left it as the featured video for a while, let people soak in all the information, I'd probably get a lot more views on all my videos, but then again I don't have time to just fucking sit there and let a game not play itself because I'm trying to... Whoa. Oh, that sucks. I just took that bitch out, whoever the hell that was. But I just, I just don't have the patience to not play a game when I want to, so... You know, people before have told me, though, I'm, though it hasn't happened recently, people before have told me that it was kind of sad that my videos only got, you know, X amount of views when I had X amount of subscribers, but I just upload way too much shit. Like, who wants to sit around and watch two hours of this crap every day? I probably wouldn't. Usually the people I watch happen to be more of the slow uploaders. But you know what? I pretty much just upload how I feel like. Yeah, nice. So I usually suggest to people that they should, uh, you know, pick one thing and and watch it, try and keep up with it. Wow, it's definitely having me. No, okay, never mind. You know, just pick one thing and and run with that. Keep up with that if you can, and you know, etc., etc. Because that's that's how I would do it. So the card dealer missions are closed, thank God. Maybe maybe it was just a short set of missions or a shorter set of missions than this stuff. 
Or maybe I'm actually getting really close. Account closed. Sweet f uh, Federico. Okay, his big sales accountant. And the only man who understands the mob finances runs a healthy sideline. Blackmailing fellow gangsters with their books. Don't bet. Okay, whatever. Uh, take him out before finishing from Gravina. Just to make sure none of these <laughs> dumb fuck guidos can pick up the pieces. That's funny. Uh, 